Hey y'all, so today is one of those days where I have just a really long list of things that I need to get done and nothing is getting done. So today's video is just going to be short and sweet, kind of a one take thing. Um, what I have on my plate today is I just, we went and did swim lessons this morning. I still haven't like fully unpacked everything from our trip. Um, and not only that, but there's like a laundry basket full of clean clothes that I never actually put away before our trip. Um, I need to go to the grocery store and get stuff. I have laundry I need to do. I had videos I need to get out and I have a couple other projects I'm working on. Our car needs an oil change. We're trying to get new countertops so that um, when we sell the house that those are good but the people are not getting back to us. Plus just like all of the normal mom things like you want to make healthy food for your family. Uh, I, want, I keep wanting to make healthy lunches for Zach which I'm doing okay at. It's just like on my mind all the time. Obviously I need to like shower and take care of myself and as far as today and yesterday goes I got, I just got a shower today but I didn't do my hair and I haven't done my makeup for two days. So anyway this is the life guys this is awesome but really it's fine like I have a long list of things to do but for me if I make a list I can I can see what I need to do and I can move forward um, so that's just what I'm doing today um, so instead of having some super creative long video for today I'm just keeping it simple and trying to connect with you moms out there I when I was at swim lessons this morning I just kind of sat there and watched as the moms came and went and and you know they're hauling kids in and out and it was just really fun watching them there are so many different types of moms out there and there are so many families so many kids and everyone is different but really we are all very similar I noticed how some of them were just like pulling their kids as hard as they could to get them out. Some of the kids were screaming because they didn't want to do the swimming lesson. Just so much of the same things that we all go through. And I just hope that you, all of you moms watching and, and dads and parents or whoever, just know that no matter what type of a group you're in, no matter what your demographic is, there are people like you and there are people who understand. And for those of you who are young moms um, who are in my shoes, what I kind of wanted to name this video today was intentional neglect. I heard that from another YouTuber. Um, I think it was Eight Passengers who I heard it from. And she was just saying like, there are so many things that we have to do. Even if you're not a mom, there are so many things you have to do. And there's always something that you have to decide to not take care of or to neglect. And neglect is kind of a bad word, but honestly, like today, or yesterday, I neglected the dishes. And so I had to take that care of that today, but I had to make that choice yesterday so that I could stay sane. Um, and let's see, today's neglect would probably have to be my hair and my makeup, obviously. I give that up so that I can spend time with my kids, I can work on my videos, and I can do other things around the house. And I think that's okay. There's things that we need to intentionally put aside for a little bit so we don't have to just worry about it trying to get to it all day long so yeah this isn't I mean this video is kind of boring and and um, the same old thing but just know for you moms out there there is one person me who doesn't always do everything when I need to and who neglects things now and then because I have to make that choice and it's okay um, it's okay to just put something aside, take care of yourself, take care of all the other million things you have to do, and come back to it later. I think it's totally cool. Um, it was really nice today. I was texting my husband, Zach, and I was just saying, I feel a little bit overwhelmed. I feel like there's just so many things I need to get done today that I'm not getting done. It was one of those days where I had so many things to do, I didn't know where to start. So I was texting him about this, and he's like, you know what? Let me take the kids to dinner when I get home, and you can just keep getting things done. Um, and hopefully you can feel better about that. And I was seriously, I just like started tearing up when I got that sweet text from him. It was just so, so thoughtful and nice. And yeah, I'm just so grateful for a husband who gets it and who who thinks about me. And I hope I can be a better, a better wife to him um, in return. <sighs> okay, I'm done. This is the end. We, um, we're all in this together, guys. Take it one day at a time. Thanks for watching, guys. Don't forget to subscribe. And don't forget to leave any comments if you have any um, comments or suggestions for the vlog. I'd love to hear them. So yeah, we'll see you guys tomorrow. Stay positive. Have a great day. Yay!